What's up, YouTube fam? It's your girl, Mona, back with another episode of Vibing with Mona. First of all, I always got to start this thing off by welcoming my new family. <laughs> welcome, 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 welcome to the new influx of subscribers that I have gotten this far. It is so dope the amount of support you guys show me and the love, the comments. I love it. Keep it coming. Of course, I have to welcome back my day one subscribers. You guys have been there for me from the jump and I appreciate each and every one of you individually. And I realized that I'm always saying, let's get into today's video. And then sometimes don't get into today's video. So I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to fix it. The secret to success is to stop wishing and start doing. I say that to say faith is taking the first step, even when you don't see the whole staircase. And with that being said, let's vibe. Now, per usual, don't forget to smash that like button. Make sure you guys leave a comment and also subscribe. Put all your questions, comments, concerns, all of that down in the comments below and I will get to you guys as quickly as possible. If it is something that I feel like should have a video behind it, I will definitely do that as well. Also, make sure you guys turn on your notifications so you are aware every time your girl posts a new video. And also, before I start, I do need to make a disclaimer, of course. So please be advised, I do not own the rights to any of the music, instrumentals, heck, even some of the pictures that you guys may see on uh, throughout some of my videos. I do not own the rights to any of these things. It is used for video purposes only. So, yeah. Also, if you guys can't already tell, I am outside recording this video, so you may hear some birds, you may hear planes, you may hear um, the cars going by, all that good stuff, so yeah, they are up, okay, they up, <laughs> but now I can go ahead and say let's get into today's video, so yes, let's go ahead and get into today's video. So as I've recently stated, you guys, make sure you're leaving any questions, anything that you want to talk about, any comments, anything, leave it down in the comment section below and I am getting to them as quickly as possible. For some reason, I don't get all of the messages or comments that you guys leave. It's like YouTube Studio picks which ones to show me. I'm not sure. Um, but because I don't go into the YouTube studio app on a regular basis, it does not show me all of the comments. Um, so they don't come to as notifications on my phone pretty much. Um, uh, but definitely continue to leave your comments, questions, again, whatever you want to talk about, leave them in the comments and I will deliver. Okay. I'll deliver. All right. Today's video is pretty much that it's pretty much me answering a subscribers question that they had regarding opening up a vending machine business so today's video is pretty much that it's me answering a question that one of you had regarding opening up a vending machine business so again let's go ahead and get into it now i didn't find anything specific because she wanted to know about grant opportunities geared towards opening a vending machine business and i searched high and low okay but i wasn't able to find a grant that was geared specifically towards that but i did find some information on you know of course how to start that business um ways that you can get financing and all that good stuff so um i'm going to talk about that today now in addition to that most of the grants that i've spoken about on this channel can be used towards anything so always go back if you haven't already check out the other grant videos because they will give you a lot of information on grants that are available now definitely be mindful that some of the grants may have already closed uh, like for example the most recent video i did were grants that you need to apply to immediately because they were closing soon meaning the beginning of uh, the month or the end of the month which we don't have long in july so a lot of people may be thinking a vending machine like who wants to have a vending machine business you know but let's be honest there are a lot of potential in a vending machine business because vending machines are everywhere you have vending machines in airports and schools at the workplace like they are everywhere and 
you got to think outside the box because a lot of people may think of food and drinks when they hear the word vending machine, but it is so much more than that. They have many other ideas, personal hygiene products, medicine, electronics, movies, games, toys. Like they have so many things other than food and drinks in these vending machines. So you really have to just think outside of the box when it comes to this kind of opportunity. All right, so there are many ways to purchase and finance vending machine equipment, and I have a couple for you here today. Now, one of the ways would be to go through distributors or people who have refurbished units. Sometimes they do offer payment terms, you know, just of course ask questions, how their terms work. Um, you know, you got to think about it like you're financing a car, and this you know since you're financing the vending machine so they'll be able to give you your terms right then and there of course always do your research before just buying into one set of terms like make sure you're getting comparisons from different places um don't just think oh this sounds like a low number and and you know go with the first thing that you hear get a couple different quotes and pick your best option so you can also purchase a pre-existing business so definitely you want to keep in mind that this is often the most expensive option because you're not only buying the equipment and inventory but you're also taking over existing contracts so you definitely want to do your research on the type of contracts that they may have like ask questions like that's the most important thing that you can do at any time is to ask questions okay so you definitely want to make sure you're doing your research on that because you're also taking over those contracts as well so you need to uh, make sure you're ex you're researching their routes their locations make sure you're inspecting the vending machines thoroughly especially if you're going this route because again you're also purchasing the equipment as well okay and I'm I'm gonna say this a million and one times do your research on this information before purchasing an existing business now today i have four lenders for you guys to consider when looking for equipment financing and of course all the links will be down in the description box below so you guys are able to go back and take a look at them at a later time all right so lindio again is our first lender now their borrowing amounts are anywhere from 2k to 5 million their terms do vary so they weren't specific as far as how long um, their term would last meaning 24 months 72 months um, so they didn't really say now they do have interest rates as low as two percent and if you know anything about interest rates that is amazing okay um, they did say additional fees may vary. So, of course, go and do your research to make sure you know everything before going into it. And they also have a couple different loan types. So, they got Merchant Cash Advance. They got SBA loans. And they also have Startup Business Loans. So, you guys definitely want to make sure you go and check them out because they have a lot to offer. So moving right along, our next lender is U.S. Business Funding, and they offer up to $10 million and terms are up to 10 years. Now, they also have a really good interest rate starting at 3.5%. Now, of course, most of the time your interest rate is going to go based off of your if you don't have a business your personal credit score so you would have to have a higher credit score um, same thing as far as business the business side of things they're gonna probably look at your business credit score possibly when it comes to determining your interest rate now they have flexible terms and payment options so um, if you're looking for something specific probably definitely you want to go through you know their website to see what those terms are again ask questions they also have a 24-hour funding process so you can get your funds in as little as 24 hours um and they also have a 95 percent approval rate so it looks like they may work with you know 
just about anybody. And I'm not going to say just about anybody, but they're probably willing to give people chances. So don't count yourself out. If you have a low credit score, um, you just may have a higher interest rate. Our next loan is coming to you from Crest Capital, and you are able to borrow anywhere from five to 500K with loans from 24 to 72 months. Now they also have a low interest rate starting at 5%. They have fixed terms, so there will be no rate adjustments. You can also do equipment, vehicle, and software financing through this company. So check them out, make sure you do your research and reach out to them if you have any questions. All right, so the last lender I have for you guys today is Direct Capital and their borrowing amount are up to 250k they have terms between 1 to 72 months and their rates start at 5.49 percent um, i wasn't able to get too much information off of this lender's website but definitely reach out to them if you have any questions they have an faq section so you can check that out as well now with the loans that i provided to you guys today all of them with the exception of Crest Capital have additional fees that may vary. So you definitely want to make sure you are asking questions before going into anything. Now there are other options to purchase or finance equipment and it can be done through things such as small business loans or business credit as well. There are a couple of small business loans out there that I have come across, so I'll definitely put together a video on that, and you guys make sure you tune in. So the last thing I wanted to touch bases with you guys on is where you can purchase these vending machines. Now, they will be on the screen, and they will also be down in the description box as well, but you can look on onlinevending.com, vending.com, naturals to go evending.com and discountvending.com those are places where you can go to purchase brand new vending machines or even refurbished <laughs> sorry refurbished vending machines i also came across a website called bizbuysell.com and they have a couple of different contracts that you can actually purchase for your vending machines like different routes so they have like flower bread route they have myrtle beach vending route that's in conway south carolina they have cash king which is in las vegas they have um, low cost business and like they have a lot okay a lot of contracts on here for you guys when you get that far into the business so i'm going to put that information down in the description box as always, I want to thank you guys for taking the time out of your busy schedule to come vibe with your girl. I do hope the information that I provided to you today is very beneficial to you or to someone that you may know. So definitely make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and share my videos. Let the world get this information. I am here to help you in any way possible. So again, make sure you leave your comments, questions, concerns, whatever you want to do a video on. Leave that down in the comment section below and I will get back to you as quickly as possible with the video, with the response, whatever. I got you because you guys got me. So as always, thank you, thank you, thank you for vibing. And until next time, practice self-care, stay humble and positive vibes only. Thank you for vibing with Mona. Na, 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 na.